Okay, so with magnesium supplements, there are two important things to think about. One is how well is it going to be absorbed? So magnesium itself is just an element. There aren't multiple forms of magnesium. Like when supplement ads come on, they go, this is the best form of magnesium or that form of magnesium. It's not a different kind of magnesium. Magnesium is freaking magnesium. It's an element. Unless you're an alchemist and you can turn magnesium into calcium or copper or gold or something, it's just magnesium. It's ignorant to talk about different forms of magnesium. But there are different forms of magnesium supplements because you're not going to find just elemental magnesium as like a lump rock or mineral in nature. Actually, you can buy magnesium in kind of a block and they use it to start fires. If you shave pieces of it off and then you hit a spark on it, it'll like ignite. It'll, it, it's so reactive in its pure ionic form, you're not gonna find it that way. And that's not how it is in any supplement. So in order to supplement with a mineral, it has to be combined with some other thing either another element like magnesium oxide, which is magnesium and oxygen. So you can find those forms, but those don't absorb very well because our digestive tract is set up to absorb nutrients. We absorb them when they're bonded to an amino acid. Like the best absorption is if you have an element or like a pure element, a mineral bonded to an amino acid, what they call chelated. That means chelated, which is like claw. Um, it's, it's hung onto by a larger amino acid molecule, which is an organic molecule that we also need nutritionally. So our gut is set up to absorb amino acids very efficiently. And if there's a mineral attached to it, we'll just bring it on in. And then the mineral and the amino acids separate from each other and the magnesium becomes a bioavailable to do whatever it does in your body.